How you guys doing? I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. This great sweatshirt edition. You know, I always do a, a season. You know what I'm saying? I do a gang of movie reviews at one time. This is gray sweat hoodie edition. So with that being said, I'm not just saying this movie is fire because I'm scared to get slapped. All right. This movie is fire because it's a good movie. To me, I liked it. It's fire. You know what I mean? That's how I felt at the moment. Maybe I was a little hyped. I haven't rewatched it, so I don't know how I feel. But when I first watched this movie, it was fire to me. And that's Bad Boys for Life. Starring Will Smith, Martin Lawrence, Vanessa Hudgens, Joe Pantolano, and Teresa Randall. Right? Let's get into it. So, to me... I love Bad Boys. I love the original one. Like, Michael Bay version, you know. It was classic Michael Bay movies, but Martin and Will brought a lot to Bad Boys 1. Like, you know, the story was simple. It was clean, fun, straight to the point. You know what I'm saying? Bad Boys 2 came out. It was hella extra. Hella door jokes and hella more tension. Hella more action scenes and hella more explosions. and Longer action scenes. I remember... It was like that movie, I thought it ended, and then like, you know, uh, what's her name? Dwayne Wade girlfriend. Uh, Gabrielle Union gets kidnapped, and then they take her to fucking Cuba, and now we got to deal with that shit? Like, that was like a whole separate movie, but that was Bad Boys 2, you know what I'm saying? And then you get Bad Boys 3, and then they, they don't even acknowledge that Gabrielle Union was in it. I mean, they do, but it's like, y'all could have did better for Sid. It'll do it way better for Sid. You know what I'm saying? She even got a spinoff show about being in Bad Boys, LA's Finest with Jessica Alba. Like, she's in the canon. Like, damn, y'all could do way fucking better now. I hope they include her in Bad Boys 4. So they, according to Martin, that's what they're going to do. But anyway, the intro is fire. You know, it's like they drive into the city in the Porsche and stuff. You think they're going to chase, but it just ends up Martin's being a grandfather. You know what I'm saying? And the rush, they just rush into the hospital. Martin's like being a grandfather, and it's like, oh, a call back to Reggie. I remember Reggie, the dude in Bad Boys 2, is like, you look like a ludicrous motherfucker, that dude, right? So it's like, it's a callback because he ended up, you know, wifing up, you know, Martin's daughter that he went to prom with. You know what I'm saying? That was a cool little callback to Bad Boys, you know, canon for everybody that's in the Bad Boys fandom. Um, so pretty much this movie is just kind of like showcasing that, you know, like Martin is old. Martin and Will is old. Will ain't trying to give it up. Martin's gave it up. He's like, yo, I'm old. I'm retired. Like, I don't need this shit. Will's like, nah, we still got it. You know, he wants to do his thing. So then Will ends up just getting into this shit because uh, they bring in this other storyline where it's like Will had this prisoner that he got or she was in witness protection, or he's protecting her, he ended up having a kid with her, and that becomes this revenge movie, and then that's that's pretty much what we got. Like, you know, Will's, like, finds out he has a son, and the son is, like, an assassin that's trying to kill him, and, you know, the jokes bounce off each other, and Martin, you know, at first he's reluctant, but he, he you know, he eventually has Will's back, you know what I'm saying? The chemistry between Will and Martin is always there. Like, you don't even need nobody else in it. I hate that they keep wasting Teresa Randall's talents. She plays uh, Teresa, actually, in the movie. You know what I'm saying? She just, they just, Marcus and Mike. That's Will and Martin. Y'all know Martin is Marcus and Will is Mike. But their chemistry is just amazing. And they keep fucking wasting Teresa Randall's fucking talent. Like, she's just always useless in these movies. But it's like, yo, I seen her in Girl 6. Like, she can act. But anyway. But their chemistry, Martin and Will, is undeniable. Those dudes are genuinely friends. And when they're on camera, you can see that they genuinely like being in that situation. It's not a job at the moment. It's like I'm working with my friend, and that plays off on camera. Um, another thing, uh, just this little gripe I got. Uh, Marcus had three kids, and I didn't see his sons in this movie. You know what I'm saying? Uh, just little things like that bother me. Like, where was his sons? Like, they couldn't sneak John Sally in this. Like, you know, John Sally was in both. It's like, I know people are like, oh, but he, nah, he worked at the, uh, the thing. Uh, spoiler alert, you know what I'm saying? This movie, oh, but if you haven't seen it, like, the captain dies, and that was sad. Um, 
Yeah, uh, this movie was just, it was just made well. Like, the directors knew how to blend new age and, you know, the dying older guys that are still trying to be cop. They blended that well. Um, there will be a fourth, like I said, Martin confirmed that, that they will be doing it even with Will's uh, situation right now. And, um, yeah, uh, you know, uh, I, I just, I just, uh, I'm going to go see it. You know what I'm saying? Um, I, I can't wait for the fourth one come out. I mean, hopefully everybody's forgiving Will. And, uh, you know, we can heal and move on. Um, like I said, I like this movie. It was fire to me. I don't give too many movies fire. Like I said, I don't know if I still would give it fire, but the action was fine. I loved it. I'm going to stick with my answer. I'm going to say fire. So with that being said, man, as usual, it's your boy, J.L. Have a good one. Stay classy. Thank you guys for checking out my page. And make sure you click that bell so you can see all the videos that I do. Follow me on Instagram. So check out the videos to the side of me because they're just as dope as the ones you just watched. And with that being said, peace and goodbye.